Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to change the video output resolution on a Xfinity X1 TV box with the Xfinity voice remote. And I'll go through this step by step. But before we begin, I wanted to let you know that I do have other videos on the Xfinity Voice Remote and on the Xfinity X1 TV Box and on the Xfinity Flex streaming device. And I'll link those videos and playlists at the end of this video. And if you're interested and have time, please check those playlists out. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is to press the Xfinity button on the voice remote and then this menu pulls up here and then we're going to press the right arrow button until we get over to the settings icon and then we'll press the circle button in the middle of the arrows to select that. And then in the settings menu, we're going to press the down arrow button until we get to device settings and then press the circle button in the middle of the arrows to select that. And then in the device settings menu, we're going to press the down arrow button until we get to video display and then press the circle button in the middle of the arrows to select that. And now we're in the video display menu and video output resolution is highlighted so we can press the circle button in the middle of the arrows to select that. And these are the different video output resolutions that you can change the Xfinity X1 TV box to. You just press the down arrow button on the voice remote until you get to the one that you want, and then press the circle button in the middle of the arrows to select that. And if you do change the video output resolution, this box will show up here and it says video output resolution. Do you want to keep this resolution? And you can select yes or no. And if you want to select no while no is highlighted, you'll use the Xfinity voice remote and press the circle button in the middle of the arrows to select that. And if you want to select yes, you'll press the right arrow button to move over to yes and then press the circle button in the middle of the arrows when yes is highlighted. And then when you're all done, you can press the exit button on the voice remote to exit out of all the menus. All right, guys, so that's just about it for this video, and I hope it was helpful, and thank you so much for watching. And like I said earlier, I do have other videos on the Xfinity Voice Remote and on the Xfinity X1 TV Box and on the Xfinity Flex streaming device. And I'll link those videos and playlists at the end of this video, and if you're interested and have time, please check those playlists out. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.